Hi everyone! For those of you who have been on my channel for a while, why would you name a vinegar for monks? Anyway, you know that my favorite cleaning solution is white vinegar and baking soda. And today's video is about white vinegar. You know I've used it for my shower, for my kitchen sink, for a couple of other things that I don't remember right now. But I'll link the videos below. And in today's video, I'm going to show you how I use white vinegar to clean three items in my kitchen very easily. In all three cases, I'm going to be cleaning hard water spots and I'm going to start with my glasses. So usually I try to wash my glasses by hand because the water here is very hard and um, I don't always have the time. So sometimes I have to put them in a dishwasher and you can see how spotty they come out. They actually sometimes come out nastier looking than they were before. So I'll start by pouring about a cup of the Four Monks vinegar into a bowl and then I will take the sponge and start rubbing the glass and if there are any tougher spots you can put a paper towel with vinegar there and just let it sit for a while but uh, that's it and then you just rinse the glass. Another thing I always clean with vinegar is the filter in my espresso machine and you can see from the hard water uh, how it uh, creates these spots right where the coffee comes out and that is impossible to wash with a sponge and dishwash soap. So what I'm going to do is in the same bowl I'm going to put the filter and I'm going to fill it up with vinegar and let it sit on each side for about 15 minutes. As you can see, the hard water spots are almost completely gone, but to give it an extra polish, I'm going to use the sponge and uh, scrub it very nicely, especially the spots where the coffee comes out. Then I'll rinse it with water and as you can see, it's as good as new. So item number two, done. And now the nastiest of all, my refrigerator. And this happens in about a month and a half. It happens really quickly and this is actually very embarrassing but you'll see what it's gonna look like in just a few minutes start by placing the water filter press into a cup that can hold at least two cups of liquid and fill it up with vinegar and then put something underneath the cup to press it up so the entire press submerges into the vinegar then take a shallow casserole put the dripping tray in it and pour vinegar until the tray is completely submerged in water and because it's going to float put something on the top of it to hold it down and let it sit there for about 15 minutes and after 15 minutes you can see how the hard water stains are starting to come out but I'm gonna use a toothbrush to give it a nice scrub then I'll rinse it with water dry it out and as you can see item number three is good as new and back here I'm gonna remove the cup and put the ice maker into it and then I'm gonna take a sponge and scrub the hard water spots from the water press and then I'm gonna scrub the ice maker side and that's it 40 minutes and my kitchen it's hard water spots free I hope you enjoyed my video if you did please give it the thumbs up and if you're new to my channel Please subscribe for more cleaning, cooking, gardening, home remedies videos. Thank you so much for watching guys. I'll see you next time. Bye.